Hey guys, it's Rack, and welcome back to more Minefields. By popular demand, we're going to start pushing out more of these episodes more quickly because they're fun as hell to make, and it sure, seems like you guys are enjoying them, so we're going to do more of this. Um, last episode, we put out the ultimatum about finding Dr. Revilo. Uh, we got some responses already. Nalbus commented on the video. He thinks it's Cray. He's trying to play blame to Cray. Oliver says even though... It's a pretty big coincidence. He, it's not him. He's being framed. And Goon seemed genuinely surprised when he found our signs in his latest video. So, Juicy hasn't been on in a while. All signs are pointing to Cray. So, we'll have to see what he has to say about that. Um, due to all the pranking lately, we haven't really been able to build anything to the point where tomorrow is 1.6. So, I'm actually going to leave my library, which is way out in that direction alone, until 1.6 hits, because I think I'm actually gonna take advantage of those, uh, of the clay blocks for that. So we're gonna, we're gonna do something a little different today. Today, we are going to do what I'm going to call the quest for chicken. We may have noticed we've got a beautiful cow farm. We have sheep, we have no chickens. So we have two quite large problems when it comes to chicken farm over here. Part, problem number one, we're so close to all this jungle, the ocelots will come and kill our chickens. So what I'm going to actually do right now, just real quick, I'm going to build ourselves a temporary shelter for when we find our chickens, just throw them in here. And then we're going to go ahead and try and find ourselves, that can stay there I suppose, we're going to try and find ourselves some chicken. I don't know why that one block is there at all. Alright good. Alright, let's put a roof on this thing, and we'll begin our search. Alright, so what I think I'm going to do uh, after we find these chickens is I'm going to, you see where those two lines are? I was, I was experimenting. I think I'm going to fill in the water over here, expand this area out a little bit more, so we can actually build something in this space right here. I think this is too much, too much beautiful space here to not have anything built in it. So, that's what we're going to do. That's, maybe we'll do some of that today as well. Um, I'm sure you've seen I've taken down that little jungle part over there. I'm really trying to terraform my area to a little more usable. Um, but across the river, I don't want to touch that mountain because it's awesome. So, without further ado, beautiful, let the quest for chicken begin. We'll start in the jungle, a biome known to have many chickens, but home to the deadly ocelot. Through the jungle, we have a marshy swamp. Little land for our chickens to land on. In the distance, a hilly plains, followed by a frozen tundra. Where will the chickens be hiding? Only you can decide. For those of you who are too young for that reference, most of you probably, that was a great old show on Nickelodeon. And we're going on a temple adventure. Alright. So uh, I figure what we'll do while we look for our chickens is... We'll also do a little bit of exploring on the server. Because I've been way out... Oh, that is a massive chunk error. And it's pretty cool. I've been way out here um, a lot. What is going on? This chunk error. Look at that. That's so cool. Ooh. What's that? That just looks like a regular mine shaft, I think. This is so cheating, and I love it. It looks like we got a mine shaft there. So cool. I love chunk errors. Um, so yeah, so I've, I've done a ton of exploring, um, but I haven't done a lot of it on camera. So I figure this could be a really good time for us to explore the, the biomes right around my home. Um, so, you know what, I'm going to reload. Chunk errors, as cool as they are, it's, it's kind of defeating the purpose of what I'm trying to do here. Alright, let's give everything a second to load up. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so as I was saying, let's see which direction is this. Okay, that way is there, that way is home, that way is home. Okay, so I've gone way out, I've explored. This is actually a cave that I came out of, you can see my pillar. Um, my home is there, swamp, jungle, forest, which is beautiful. And uh, we're actually gonna, I actually have no idea where the chickens are. So we may just run and pull out them in like two seconds, or we may be traveling forever. I traveled so far just to find cows. 
when I built my cow farm that I'm hoping we don't have that problem with the chickens because God knows the cows were annoying enough. So we got back into swamp. All right. Okay. We, wow, a chicken. We got one. And when there's one, there's usually more. Oh, this is the best adventure. I thought we were going to have to go ridiculously far. All right. All right. We'll start with you, little one. You eat seeds now, don't you? Oh, here you go, little chicken. All right, you're the first of the chickens. You'll have a special place in the chicken hierarchy. We'll call you... What should we call you? What? Okay, we're going to call you Sand Chicken. Because you get stuck in the sand, little... Where, what is going on with you? Sand Chicken? Oh my god, my chicken is... Okay, this way, this way. Come here, come here, come here. Up the sand. Alright. Okay, sand chicken. Find me your buddies. Find me your buddies. We want your buddies. Oh, yeah, here you go. Hello, little sand chicken buddy. What? Sand chicken is a glitch chicken now. Oh, there you go. Now you're walking like a normal chicken. Alright, we got two of you. You know what? I'll do it. I'll take two. I'll breed you until we have more. Let's go home. Fantastic. Now the quest to get home. Come here. Here, chickens. Here, little chickens. Oh, God. Come on. You can flutter down. That's the best part. Cows, stupid. Jump off cliffs, can't fly. Hurt themselves. I lost a cow doing that. Chickens are smart, though. Yes, you are. Yes, you are, little chickens. This way, chicken. Let me just make sure I'm going the right way. I am. This way, little chickens. Uh-oh. This is the worst part. I have to eat. Don't run away. Get back here, chicken. Stay here. See, sand chicken is... He's good. This guy, he's good. You, you're bad. Is that a bad wolf? No, that's a tree. <gasps> you came to find your buddy. I saw him. Let's get one more of you guys. Your little buddy. Your little buddy. <gasps> and an egg. This is the perfect day. Here we go, buddies. Where'd your egg go? I picked you up already. Perfect. All right, guys. We need a game plan if we're going to get home. Okay. The ocelots are coming for us. We need to make a run for it. You go right. You go left. You guys are both distractions. Sand chicken, you're the only one that matters. If you make it home, we win the game. Let's go. Stealthy, please. Be on the lookout for dangerous ocelots. Come on. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Beautiful. We're approaching the dangerous border. I can see the jungle from here, guys. Must be stealthy. Like true chicken thieves. Whisper into our voices only. Don't let the ocelots know we're coming. If they do, I'll try to take them out with a sword or a bow. But you better run for the hills. Come here, cross the dangerous ocean. Also known as a river. Here we go. Oh. Here we go. Okay, guys, deep breaths. Here, some seeds for some power energy. Beautiful. Eat those. Come on. Let's go. And let's go. Shh. Stop clucking. You're going to give us away. Oh, my gosh. It's like, it's like sand chicken's the only one that knows what's going on. He's the only one that's staying quiet. Shut up, chicken distraction number one and number two. Stop talking. We've entered the dangerous territory of the mighty ocelot. Ocelots are known to live in packs where they hunt with their babies, trying to eat as many chickens as they can. You can see here, we've entered the domain 
of the Temple Ocelot. The Temple Ocelots are known to jump from trees, pouncing on their prey before they even know what hit them. Let's go, let's go. Up here, up we go. Oh my gosh, guys. We must continue to move quietly through the Ocelot territory. Oh my god. I just got a minefield Skype from Blurry. I think he recorded his first episode, but he's going to alert the Ocelot of our presence. Let's go. Quickly. We're almost through their territory. It's getting night time. It's perfect hunting season for the Ocelot. We must move. No! We must save you all! This way! Quick! Down the... down the... Stay low to the ground! The ocelots like to hunt from trees! Let's make our own path through the jungle! Oh no! Sand chicken! Where's your brethren? We've lost him. This now is not a time to take a poop. We must continue moving. <sighs> Unbelievable, this chicken. Distraction chicken number one does not even understand. Now is not the time to poop. Up, up we go. There, don't drown now. Let's go. Flap those wings. We made it back to dry land. Quickly, quickly through the reeds. Oh my god, one of you pooped an egg. I need eggs. I'll take it. Quickly this way. Oh my gosh, another egg pooped. free. The last dangerous area, the open plains. There's nowhere to hide. There's nowhere to run. Let's make it to this shelter. Let's go! Four minefields! The ocelot pops out now. It will be one cunning. No, no, no! I understand you're scared! We can't turn back now! We've come so far! Please! Have faith for five more minutes! I will get you home! Sand chicken, please! In safety, we can breed. All right, you guys stay here. I will deal with the ocelots. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you like that little chicken adventure. Um, what we're gonna do now is I think I want to terraform this area just a bit, like I said. Um, I'm gonna run out of dirt though because Nelbis stole all my dirt again. 
silly novice. I'm gonna get you for that one day. And uh, yeah, I think I think we're gonna we'll fill this in. Probably do some of this off camera because it's gonna be annoying to watch. Um, and then we'll prepare for our uh, next episode when we're gonna build. I think we're gonna build them a real chicken coop, like a real barn, a real barn-like chicken coop. Um, I'm still trying to work out how exactly I want one of the systems to work. Um, I don't want to give anything away right now because if it doesn't work out, that would be sad for me. Um, but I'm definitely going to build them the chickens a permanent structure. So that's why we went adventuring to get them. Um, my wife already helped me up come up with a really cool design, um, which I'm really excited to use. You may notice that my... Well, I don't know if you can see in the dark here. Let's hope you can, because I'm underwater. But you may see that my uh, my breath... I could stay underwater a really long time right now. Um, I have a Respiration 3 Aqua Affinity 1 Helm now, because uh, I went clay farming with my Silk Touch Shovel to get the clay blocks nice and quickly. So that's, uh, that's why I can stay down here so long. Okay, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to cut here. I'm going to fill in more of this. I don't think I have enough dirt right now because of now this. So I'll, I'm going to use what I can. I'm going to go grab the rest of it from my house, whatever's left. Because he stole, like, another chest full. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I'll be right back. All right, guys, we've used all the dirt that we have in our house. Um, I have more over by the library, which we'll head there in a second. But I wanted to do this. I think this will work. I think it'll be pretty cool on camera. So let's uh, let's do this. Oh man, last time I did this, it chain reactioned like a beast. It's like doing it in rows. It's pretty cool. Anything that's not connected, the whole row, if it's not connected to the water, go, ooh, like that. It just goes. Really cool. So we still gotta fill in the rest of this. Let's gather up all these. Alright. We have rooms to go up. Alright, beautiful. Alright, so let's go head over to the library area. And I see, I'm still not sure what I'm going to do over here. I built this little forest here of oak, which I'm probably going to chop down just for wood and apples and stuff. Because I've actually cured now three villagers. Not you've seen, You saw the one on camera two episodes ago. I now have three, which is awesome. Um, I'm hoping, I, I built them a little complex of rooms so that I'm hoping that maybe they'll breed and give us more and I always do this I always go up this mountain here and up that way but in reality to get to to get to the library I really should I need to come this way it's faster I'll have to jump off a cliff beautiful so the library yes don't worry I have not forgot about it this is really still the next big project that I'm gonna do um, it's gonna be it's going to be a really, really long process, multiple episodes long. Um, but I, yeah, I am waiting. Tomorrow is 1.6. I'm excited about the clay blocks. So I, I, I'm i going to play with my designs based on that. So you can see, look at this. Here's like, I have to keep like a secret stash of this stuff so that like it doesn't get stolen for no reason. So let's just take dirt. Beautiful. As much dirt as I can take. That looks like, oh, uh, let's get rid of that. <laughs> I have so much stuff here. And uh, let's take that, and we'll go, we'll finish filling it in, and we'll probably call it an episode for the day. Uh, you know, we did have our chicken adventure, which was the key. And uh, I'm actually really excited to build the barn-type structure in the next episode. My wife really, she put in a lot of work to help me come up with a really fun design. Um, I'm hoping that I can, like, get that design, really make it fit in that space in the world here. Um, it's a little bit bigger than I originally intended, but what it really made me realize is our our house, as awesome as it is, it's a starter home. It's small. We're gonna need to, to build ourselves a really nice big house somewhere. So I was thinking, uh, I don't know, maybe if I clear out some jungle and put it on like a cliff top or a hillside, but again, this is all just spitballing. If you guys have any awesome ideas on what to do house-wise, Please let me know because I'm totally 
I'm so torn on what to do um, housewise. So I would love to hear what you guys think about that. Um, other than that, uh, I, I'd like to hear your guys' thoughts on Dr. Revilo. We've got a couple in the comments in the last episode. Some think they don't think it's Oliver. Some saying they think it's Cray. I would, I'd love to hear what you guys think. And then, if we don't get him turned over to us, I want to hear from you guys who you want us to prank first. Because I've got pretty much a prank lined up for just about everybody. And whoever I don't have one lined up for, I can make it happen. So, um, we're also going to work on in the near future um, getting our sheep farm up and running more efficiently. Um, I need Cray for some of the redstoning that I have in mind because, to be honest with you, I have no idea how to do it. And he's the redstone guy on the server. I think Oliver is also really good at redstone, but I don't know that yet because I haven't seen enough. You know, he hasn't. He's been. He's still relatively new on the server. I haven't seen enough of his redstone making to tell if he's if he's the guy I'm looking for because he actually tends to be a little bit easier for me to get online at the same time with. The time zone is not as massive of a of an inconvenience for him as it is for the Australian guys because it's like six hours instead of twelve, and we can find like some common time. So I have a. Man, I'm gonna, I've got like a couple of redstone things in mind, and I'm so not good at redstone that I'm really hoping that we can pull it off. So we're almost done filling our lake. Um, I'm probably just going to fill in the rest uh, off camera really quick, but uh, I'm going to end the episode here. I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I know this is probably a little bit of a shorter episode. Part of it is because we found our chickens way faster than I thought we were going to. I thought we were in for a trek of our lives to get back. Um, but I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Let me know. Uh, if you're not already following us on Facebook, please do. Minefields Facebook. It's pretty active. It's fun. It's it's. Guys are constantly th screenshots, and you know you'll constant updates on when our new episodes are out. Um, if you also want, follow me on Twitter. Uh, it's in the description. All in every episode. Um, you'll hear right away when episodes go live. Um, occasionally get updates on when I have something exciting coming out. Um, I got a question about a 300 sub subscriber. We are very close. Um, I originally hadn't planned on doing anything until 500 sub subscribers. That was the goal that we have set. We have, no, we actually are. We're getting. We're, we're marching along nicely. Um, so I might do something small for 300, but it's not going to be in our sub shrine. I'm going to wait for that one for 500. Um, I have a really fun idea for the 500 sub shrine. So. Tell your friends, let's get on that. We can see what we're gonna do. Um, I think also we're gonna do we're gonna do face cam for 500, 500 subs. I don't know how I'm gonna pull it off yet, uh, but we're gonna do it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys later.